NASA has long been at the forefront of space exploration, and over the years they've amassed a huge collection of photographs. These show some of the incredible objects that can be found close to us, and it's led to people looking through the huge library in the hopes of finding something interesting. Just recently, someone reported that they found an interesting image that was taken close to the Orion Nebula, and when they zoomed in they said they could see a strange looking object that was in the shape of a cylinder. What's interesting about this photograph is that this isn't the first time that one of these objects have been found in this area, and this has led to some sharing their opinions on what they think the object could be. The object that was found a while back was taken by an astronomer who was using a powerful telescope, and when they reviewed the images they could see that a large object could be seen. This new photograph was posted on groups online that investigate strange objects, and many of those who saw the image said that it matched strange crafts that had been witnessed all around the world. There were some that suggested the objects could have been something like space debris, noting that NASA and other researchers have often said this is the most common explanation. But others pointed out that those who take part in astrophotography are sometimes reporting that they see similar objects. The fact that this one was detected so close to the other objects led some to suggest that they could be scattered all throughout our galactic neighbourhood. What these objects are though is still heavily debated. Many users suggested that these objects could be similar to the mysterious Oumuamua, an object that was described by scientists as looking like a large cigar, or a squashed disc. Interestingly, when scientists locked onto this object, they knew it was something completely different, noting that it was travelling at around 57,000 miles per hour, or 90,000 kilometres per hour, with them saying that from its speed this was something that was new to physics. It's not just everyday people who have suggested that these strange looking objects may have been sent from another planet. There's even a group of highly qualified astronomers that have suggested that Oumuamua may have been a probe sent from an advanced civilization. If this is the case then it would mean that we have direct proof that we could have been observed by an advanced piece of technology, an idea that has excited many researchers. As of right now it's anyone's guess as to what these objects are. One of the most respected careers in the world as well as one of the most hopeful dreams of many is that of one day becoming an astronaut. Though no one doubts that attaining such a position commands overwhelming respect, it appears that many seem to disregard this notion when dismissing the strange claims a number of astronauts have made during their time in space. Although the account of Dr. Story Musgrave details that of a strange creature outside a spacecraft during two different solo space missions, He'd later go on to claim that he does not believe that the sighting itself was evidence of anything strange, but did go on to detail that he thought the creature was real. According to Dr. Story Musgrave, as he was undergoing his solo mission, he described that he'd begun to observe a strange snake-like creature following his craft. He would later provide an interview in 1994, in which he would state that the creature appeared to be a living snake that moved across space and followed his craft for quite some time. He believed that perhaps the creature was terrestrial, and had gotten up into the upper atmosphere to journey close to the spacecraft. Additionally, Dr. Story Musgrave said that such creatures were common in space, and that during any prolonged space mission, it was relatively commonplace for him to see a space snake following behind the craft. Dr. Story Musgrave would also gather clips of video footage of the space snakes, to which more closely resembled creatures similar to that of a pyrosome, which can be found deep within the ocean. These creatures have become known as the Musgrave eel, and are formally rejected by the National Aeronautics and Space Administration as being a legitimate sighting of any kind. Dr. Story Musgrave claims that to this day he's not entirely sure what the creatures could be, and that he has no explanation for his sightings. It's not just Dr. Story Musgrave that has had a strange encounter. Back in 2003, China sent their first man to space. 
His name was Yang Liwei, and proved to be China's first ever astronaut that would also begin his first space mission as a solo mission, going to space completely alone without any additional members to join him. Although it's quite well known that isolation can play tricks on the mind, it appears that one of the strangest occurrences to have happened to Yang Liwei would also be one caught on recording. According to Yang Liwei, as he was sitting at the controls of the ship, he began to hear what first sounded like a loud banging sound. As he searched around the ship, he claimed to have heard the sound of someone knocking on the outside body of the spaceship, similar to that of a wooden hammer striking the side of an iron bucket. This led to him spending a large amount of time peeking out of the portholes of the ship, in order to see what could be knocking on the outside of the ship. After some time he had believed that perhaps he'd misheard the anomaly, only to be reminded of his experience when the recordings captured the phenomenon in intense detail. Interestingly enough, the following Chinese solo missions, the space mission of 2005 and 2008, had their astronauts also report the strange knocking sound occurring at random times during their missions. Today, the cause of these strange reported knocking sounds is still unknown, but appears to be a standard occurrence for Chinese missions to space. So what do you make of these interesting discoveries? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comment section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.